What is going on YouTube? I hope you are having an amazing day. I've got a really cool knife for you guys. This is the Petrified Fish EO5 Flavorist. And I can honestly say this is the most well-designed front flipper I have ever handled. And that's pretty crazy because this thing is only $45 guys on Amazon comes in a few different colors I got the black micarta you can get it in the OD green so right off the bat let's talk about the overall design and the blade shape so the handle super ergonomically designed obviously is micarta really smooth micarta we got the back spacer which is also micarta we also got the lanyard hole the pocket clip is very well designed. I'm pretty sure the pocket clip is actually titanium. And then the blade is K10, also known as D2 steel. And as you can see, the action is 100% drop shutty. Like, just watch. I don't have to shake it at all, and it just and the front flipping action is so well designed it's just so easy to flip open i never really liked front flippers to be honest until i got this knife and at first like the first few flicks didn't go like perfect but once you get it figured out it's quite amazing and i've seen people like be able to flip it like this with their finger i cannot do that so you might be able to do that but don't expect to be able to do that and yes the blade shape design it's like a, a drop point slash a bellied warncliffe type of blade super good for edc utility cuts and just your typical edc tasks probably not the most ideal blade shape for self-defense obviously you wouldn't get much piercing capabilities with this blade shape, but slicing, chopping, believe it or not. And I did test this out on some cardboard. I sliced through quite a bit of cardboard and then I tested the edge retention afterwards just to see how it held up. And it held up surprisingly well. It was still be able to slice through receipt paper with ease. I was able to make squiggly lines through the receipt paper after cutting some cardboard. So, and it was a decent amount. It wasn't like a crazy amount of cardboard, but I was slightly impressed. But yes, also when you if you order this knife from Amazon, Petrified Fish does send you this. This nice lint-free cloth comes with this lint-free but carry bag. The carry bag is obviously too small to fit the knife in it, but it's big enough to fit this. Not really sure what this is. I think it's like a um, a little pry bar fish thing slash um, paracord holder. Super cool, actually. I obviously have a bottle opener. It says petrified fish on there so yeah the clip is pretty sure the clip is titanium the screws are nice and recessed in there well the screws are not recessed but the clip is recessed into the scales which is nice and you can hardly feel the clip in your hand hardly noticeable the it does go in and out of your pocket with ease I can say that for sure so yes, the lock bar, super accessible. There is a little cutout for it there. Super easily accessible. You can literally just fidget with this knife for hours and it will not you're it will not be uncomfortable. Like I have flipped this knife so many times and it doesn't wear out your thumb because it doesn't ever slide. It's so well designed, it just grips your thumb perfectly and it just throws the blade out. 
guess a little bit more about the action, just the detent is so well tuned, like it stops there, which is an early detent for the closing position, like super early, I'm super impressed by that, like you hardly will catch that, it'll just fall right past it pretty much every time. Obviously, it's going to be on ball bearings. I'm not sure. Probably ceramic ball bearings. So, yeah, let's talk a little bit about the, the steel on this knife. On the blade, it says K10, but don't let that fool you. That is D2 steel. They're exactly the same thing. So, yeah, for the price, I'd say D2 is a pretty good option for EDC just because it has pretty good edge retention. It has pretty good toughness. It's not going to be the most easy to sharpen, but it's fairly easy compared to other harder steels all right guys that's all i have for you today i hope you enjoyed this video give it a thumbs up if you did if you found it helpful thanks for watching have a good evening peace